Toby Ellis, co-founder of the FBA, barflare.org. There's a, a theory that we made up. Um, it's called the Notaboom cycle. It's named after Stefan Notaboom. Stefan Notaboom. Notaboom. Yep. And it's a basic cycle that I think all flare bartenders go through, no matter if they start bartending because of flare or they decide to learn flare after they've been a bartender. And once you start flipping, as soon as you flip a bottle behind a bar, people will say, well, that's great, but, you know, can you make a good drink? So then, even if you can't make a good drink, you commit yourself because you're that kind of person. All right, I'm going to learn how to make great drinks. So then you make great drinks. Yeah, that's great, but are you fast? So then you go home and you practice being fast. Yeah, that's great, but, you know, are you entertaining? You have a good personality. So you start learning how to build a clientele, and it's, it's a cycle that I think is unavoidable because you want people to respect you as a bartender, and if they don't respect the flair um, or they try to knock you in another way, it, it becomes this mission where you just want to say, look, I, I do everything that a bartender should do. I just happen to be throwing things around while I do it because I love it. And it becomes a part of you. Yeah, it's not, it's, I don't know, is it for you? It's harder for me to pick a glass up. <laughs> and not throw it in the air. <laughs> it's, it, it's like, okay, just pick it up, don't flip it, and it, it's just, I love what I do. Exactly. This is how I show it. I get paid to play. Love that.